I'm Carolyn, and we're here in the Feed the Need in Durham Rare House. It is a Responding to Hunger campaign. We have seen so many cool and unique ways that our community is hosting food drives for us during these unusual times. First, we're going to hear from Elle from Remax Jazz about how she hosted a food drive. Good afternoon, everybody. It's Elle Primo here with Team Nope's Remax Jazz. I'm here with my sons, Michael and Andrew. We went around last week and dropped off some donation bags to our neighbors, uh, just doing a small mini food drive, uh, looking to help feed the need in Durham. Uh, we had an amazing response, 333 pounds of food. That is up to, what, 277 meals we have donated to Feed the Need Durham during, during their um, um, responding to hunger uh, campaign. We would just like to uh, thank all of our neighbors because without you it wouldn't have been possible. with Tim, Executive Vice President here at Stonehard, and they have recently done a food drive on behalf of Feed the Need in Durham under the Responding to Hunger Together campaign. Take it away, Tim. Oh, well, uh, thank you. It's a joy every year. This is one of our favorite events that our social committee puts on. Uh, we get great participation, as you can see. We make it a challenging, um, competitive environment, and we have a lot of competitive people in our office. Um, and happy to say we um, uh, brought all this in in a period of two weeks um, and unfortunately my team did not win. We were <laughs> close but uh, did not win so great to see the participation of our office staff though. Uh, really good uh, turnout this year so really happy with what uh, we were able to put together. Oh that's amazing well thank you so much we can't do what we do without our community so we're very grateful for your support and just remind me how many cans of tuna was that? 800 and Kelsey? 38. 838, 838 cans yeah. of tuna. And how many peanut butter? 100 and Kelsey? 103. Wow. How about shampoo? Uh oh. Kelsey, take this one away. I don't remember. Uh, a lot of shampoo, lots of too. Shampoo. Amazing. Yeah. Thank you yeah. so much for your support, and uh, we look forward to meeting again next year. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Stoneheart. It was an amazing visual display of your food drive. Awesome. Thanks for making a difference in your community. We're heading now to the Connect GTA truck launch event taking place at Hardy John's today in Ajax. And here we are, Connecting GTA truck launch. Take it away with Sharmila, Angela and Sir Russ. Hi, uh, I'm Sharmila Pereira and today we are here uh, for the truck launch uh, to celebrate our frontline workers. Behind me, me you will see the beautiful truck uh, that was actually done by Angela from Big Wraps. Uh, it is uh, uh, her uh, artwork and her brainchild uh, which went into this beautiful truck. Uh, and here we have Suresh Kumar uh, who is the president of CGTA. Connecting GTA is a club for business people and as business people we come together not just to do business with each other but also to assist each other in the furtherance of our business. Um, so today we recognize our frontline workers and our truck will go from uh, the east to the west, right? Yes. Every single day um, saying thank you uh, to, our, um, to our frontline workers uh, and, uh, and we do appreciate all what they have done. Today we also are here to recognize and assist Feed the Need Durham. Um, and this is an organization that we love because they assist uh, so many people in our region um, in, in order not to be hungry. Uh, so uh, Feed the Need Durham, we understand that uh, you support the community, uh, about 100 organizations and soup kitchens. And uh, we as Connecting GTA members uh, love, would love to support you in your venture to ensure that nobody in Durham region goes hungry. Um, and so thank you very much uh, to everybody that came out today and uh, thank you to CGTA um, and I'm Sharmila Pereira, I'm a, a, a founder member of CGTA as well as a committee member for uh, Feed the Need in Durham. So I'm happy to be here to connect these two wonderful organizations uh, in a wonderful venture that we are uh, doing today. Um, to thank, thank our frontline workers and to feed the need uh, in our community.